Welcome back to this exciting show. And from wherever you are watching us, this is your favorite show, The Youth Space. And today, we're streaming live from the leafy suburbs of Karen. And we have a surprise for you. We are launching our new program. That is the Youth Space Business Edition. And in this first episode, we are featuring this exciting and amazing retreat center located in the leafy suburbs of Karen, the cooperative retreat and conference center. If you're planning business meetings, business conference, business summits, family vacation, wedding plans, this is the right place to be, the cooperative retreat and conference center. So guys, sit back, enjoy the journey as we tour this great place to get to know more about it. But before then, support this channel by subscribing, liking, and sharing this video. The Cooperative Retreat and Conference Center, it's owned by the Cooperative University. This facility was established in 2004. Uh, managed by the cooperative university. Uh, I'm the manager for the facility for the last five years. It has been an honor being given this position. Okay. Yeah. We've always been receiving very good recommendation from our clients. Okay. We have an online feedback reporting from our clients. When they leave our facility, mm -hmm. we take their contacts, we SMS them, they give us a feedback. So far, we have an excellent uh, recommendation in terms of our food production, in terms of uh, accommodation, in terms of conferencing. We usually get very good recommendation. That's why we usually have repeat clients. We are now in the restaurant. Wow. As much as I've, I'm in my mask, but I tell you the aroma in this place, guys, you can't believe me. And we are here with the man in charge. The man after all that we're seeing here. The aroma, the arrangement. Only one man, Mr. Cheng, and he's here with us. Thank you. Mr. Cheng, yes. tell us something. Uh, my name is Wilbox Mr. Cheng. I'm the man in charge of the restaurant. I'm the food and business supervisor. Okay. In charge of the whole kitchen. I control the kitchen and the service area. Uh, our restaurant has a capacity of 60. Capacity of 60? Capacity of 60. Then as we go outside, we can accumulate roughly 100 packs in the city. Inside the 60, outside we can accumulate 40. 40. The model of service mostly is the buffet. Buffet type of service, buffet service? because uh, we are in, in uh, COVID uh, season, mm -hmm. we must be very cautious on how we serve our clients. Mm -hmm. So, most of the time, we serve them from the buffet. We don't allow them to touch the cutters or all the place by, by themselves. Exactly. Everything we serve them from the buffet. Then, in terms of, uh, of staffing, I work, uh, I've got uh, roughly two service staffs mm -hmm. working under me as the Maibua. And Rose, mm -hmm. Rony, who will be coming in the evening. Okay. Then on the supporting staff, we also engage our catering students mm -hmm. like uh, Marion and uh, Dorothy. Mm -hmm. As of now, they are, they, they, they are coming on voluntary basis. On voluntary basis. As they learn at the same time. Yeah, you are catering students. Yes. Okay. Catering, catering students. Okay. Then, 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 then. On top of that, as we go outside, mm -hmm. when you go outside, we also have the other the, the the block behind uh, this facility. The gallery, the, the, uh -huh. Behind this facility, uh -huh. and the block this block B area. In terms of graduation, when we are in full capacity, uh -huh. we do have tents so that at least we are more. more. We just head into the kitchen to see how these stuff are being prepared. Who is in charge of preparation? Because the aroma in this place, guys, the aroma in this place, you can't wait to see. The root cause, the source, because as we say, the product is as important as the process. So guys, join me 
As Mr. Cheng takes us into the kitchen to get to know what's happening. You're most welcome. Okay, my name is Nancy Owichi. Uh, the staff you see here, they're all trained. In this kitchen, we work in two shifts. Okay. We have morning shift and afternoon shift. Whereby morning, morning shift starts from 6 to 2, and afternoon shift starts from 2 to, to 10 p.m. Like, like right now, okay. we have a full board. By full board, I mean we have uh, visitors who are, are being accommodated here. They sleep here. Mm -hmm. We provide them with breakfast. Mm -hmm. We have 10 o'clock tea. Mm -hmm. We have lunch. We have 4 o'clock tea. And we have a dinner. Okay. Apart from that, we also host uh, day conference customers, mm -hmm. whereby they, they come for their conferences. By day, when we have day, co day conference customers, we serve them with 10 o'clock tea, serve them with lunch, and 4, four o'clock tea. Okay. In this kitchen, we, we mainly provide three for three. Housekeeping, uh, the staff we are for, Staff, uh -huh. and we have a uh, number of 49 rooms, and this is the biggest room, the deluxe room. This one, uh -huh. uh, we are able to accommodate at one given time of uh, eight, uh, 64, people. 64 people because we have also another accommodation place at the other side of the students' area. And uh, for the double, this is single, we have around 18 doubles in separate rooms, uh -huh. and the rest around 56 are singles. Beds. 18 doubles, 18 and, doubles 56 and 56 singles. singles. And this is the biggest, this, this is the deluxe. Is the deluxe yeah. So there's, a, there's a, a, var a variation in prices from deluxe and uh, mm, the singles? Yeah? No, the variation comes in full board oh. or half board okay. or just bed only. Our rooms are self-contained, mm -hmm. they have toiletries, there is hot shower and we also have a laundry facility. If you want the thing to be cleaned, we have a laundry down there. Okay for insiders and outsiders. Okay. Yes. This is one of our big rooms in at the center. Mm -hmm. You can accommodate, depending with the group. Okay. And uh, adhering to the COVID-19 uh -huh. matters, we are able to accommodate from 50 to 60 people. 50 to 60. Yeah, we have also another one for 20 people, okay. another one for around 8 to 10 people. So we have... Uh... Such three. like rooms three. We have three, but different sizes. Different sizes. Yes. So this this, this one this of is the, this the, largest. the largest. Yes. So initially before COVID. Before COVID, we could accommodate a hundred, and the other one could accommodate forty, the other one twenty. But now with the COVID, the numbers have gone down. The numbers have gone down. So we accommodate very few. Cooperative retreat and conference center. This is a center to look at. Okay. This is a center where you'll get comfort. This is a center where the environment is so conducive for conferencing, training, team building. Just call it. Anything that comes with the events, we organize. We also do outside catering. We also do so many activities. Even for youth, we can tailor made any program you want us to, to do it for you. Mm -hmm. We can do it. So if you're looking for a conducive environment, comfortable security, a facility which is under surveillance of the CCTV. We have a 24-hour security. This is the place to be.